Um, <laughs> well, something is brewing this morning at Mandarin High School, and the students are all perked up as they're enjoying a brand new campus amenity called the Horsepower Cafe. Wouldn't you have given anything to have had this for yourself in high school? Uh, I, I, re I didn't start drinking coffee until after high school, oh. but it probably would have helped me a lot. <laughs> I'm mean, not going to lie. Well, let's find out. <laughs> Channel 4's Chris Shriver got a good taste this morning. Students at Mandarin High School have plenty to smile about, even if the school day begins before the sun comes up. It's hard. My classes start at 7, bell rings at 7.05. Chartwells continues to push the culinary envelope and change student dining by introducing the Horsepower Cafe right here in the school cafeteria. Students told us what they wanted, and what they really wanted was a place not just to grab some great hot coffees, iced coffees, um, but they really wanted a place to recharge, to socialize, and that's what we really wanted to give them. We wanted to give them the cafe feel. The company that introduced food trucks as a dining option to the district is now operating a coffee house right here on campus, and the reviews are in, and it's a hit. Over the years, we've seen different programs added, but the cafe is a nice little perk, as it were, for our children who get to come in out of the cold and buy a cup of coffee or a cup of hot uh, chocolate or even a cup of hot tea if they so desire, even at breakfast or at lunch, because it's open all day up until lunch, after lunch it closes. Uh, the kids are really enjoying it. You see a long line all the time. With high top tables and those all-important charging stations, students can skip that stop on the way to school, grab a cup of joe, get a healthy snack, meet with friends, and have no issues with staying alert in class. And it's the best perk in the school. It gives students an extra perk and energy in the morning to start off classes. And it's especially nice when we have cold days like these and we just need to stay warm. And we can go to our little tables over there and even charge our phones in the morning. And it's a nice place to get together and talk in the morning. Yeah, those are some happy kids there. Yeah. <laughs> I don't blame them. <laughs> wow. Chartwell's hopes to put coffee shops in more Duval County schools in the near future. And the name was the result of a contest held among the students to make, make it their own. So you could say there's a latte school spirit there. <laughs> I don't know. And the schools changed so much. All I had was like uh, the, the perk of our school. We had like this nasty salad bar that was kind of a little frightening. I'm not going to lie. And that was that was like the big thing. The only perk we had was seniors could eat outdoors. That was it. That was it. <laughs> I got like coffee shops well, and well, charging stations. Seriously? Are you kidding me?